Hey, feeling good, like I should. When in Durban, walk around the neighborhood. Feeling blessed, never stressed. Got that sunshine on my Sunday best. Welcome to the Boys and News Center. I'm Dylan. And I'm Elia, bringing you the news and sports for Thursday, February 6th. Let's get started. Today's word of the day is acqui acquiesce, meaning to agree to or to give in to. Used in a sentence, apparently the contractor expected me to acquiesce being overcharged. Now to a video about freshman athlete Kylie Hayes. How did it feel to win Female Athlete of the Year? It felt good. It was a surprise. I, I wasn't expecting it. So. Is your family a big influence when it comes to sports? Yeah. Um, I've tried most sports, but archery was the one that stuck, and they're very supportive. So. How long would you like to continue archery? I would like to continue it for as long as I can do it, as long as I'm able to. Is there any way you'd like to grow in archery? Any way you I would like to get better. Um, I've been working with like a new coach to try to get better, and it's helped a lot. So, The Blazer track and field team is in need of dedicated team managers. There will be an interview process for this position. Stop by room 223 before or after school to pick up a form. See Coach McGee for more details. The Bowling Blazers took on Lawrence, Shawnee Mission West, Shawnee Mission East, and Shawnee Mission North up at Lawrence Tuesday evening. The varsity ladies finished in fourth place, just 25 pins out of second place. The JV ladies and gentlemen both finished in second place. The varsity gentlemen led up the lanes with their top series of the season, losing by just under 40 pins to Shawnee Mission West. The team heads out to Olathe Lanes East on Friday. That's all we have for sports. Now on to good lucks. Good luck to the boys' basketball teams playing at home today. Freshman A starts at 5.30 p.m. Freshman B starts at 7 p.m. Boys and Girls Varsity Senior Night is tonight at 6 p.m. Good luck, GEHS Culinary Team, competing tomorrow in the Johnson County Community College HCA High School Culinary Competition. Now for the Thursday Chuckle, brought to you by... Why did the golfer wear two shirts? I don't know. Why did he wear two shirts? Why? In case he got a hole in one. Ha, 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 ha. Blazers, remember there is a pep assembly tomorrow and there will be no seminar. That is all we have for you today. You are now free to travel. Have a thrilling Thursday, and we will see you back here on Monday.